Hello, hello, hi YouTube. So today I am going to be showing you a hair tutorial how I go from this to the wet look. So stay tuned. So first I'm gonna start by removing my scarf and ooh, look at that hair. <laughs> and I'm going to get conditioner, just regular conditioner, and it is by Carol Stodder. I'm going to mix it in a spray bottle with water and make sure it's mixed pretty well before applying it to my hair. I then use a spray bottle to spray conditioner and water mixture all over my hair and make sure that I drench the hair pretty well and while doing so run my fingers through it to prepare for detangling it in order to get the required look. I then take this little brush that I stole from my old roommate. I don't know where she got it from, but it's really good at detangling. I think they sell them at beauty supply stores. Um, but I use the brush to brush through my hair. And I'm doing this very gently because um, it'll hurt. But I like the way that this brush gives definition to my hair and how it gets out all of the kinks and give it that really curly look that I like. So I continue doing this and um, I continue applying water and brushing it until it looks the way that I would like it to look. And yeah, and make sure that I separate the hair and get all the pieces so that the texture can match all over my head. Normally when I'm doing this, I feel like it doesn't take me that long, but watching it on video, it seems to be dragging, so I'm gonna speed it up a little bit. Okay, so finally, I think I am satisfied with the definition of my curls and it is wet enough. So I am done brushing, finally. I feel like I was brushing for three days. So now I am looking at my hair and I see that it is a little uneven. So I'm gonna take the scissors and try to even it out. I cut off way more than I meant to 
Um, yeah, that was not intentional, but hey, we're gonna make it work because we are positive people over here. <laughs> so now I'm gonna add mousse. Um, I just used dry foam. I like to apply that to my hair while it's still wet so that it could hold the curls. And I lather it and I mix it all over to make sure that the style will hold throughout the day. And this will last for maybe a week if I take care of it with the shine and the water and leave-in conditioner, which is pretty much all I add for this style to get it the way that I want it to be. And you just add as much as you need, more or less. I try not to add so, so much because I don't like um, my shirt being wet and I do my hair and I don't like when people touch my hair and it still feels wet because I don't like touching people's hair and it feels wet. I never like that. So next I'm gonna use the blow dryer to I guess diffuse it. Um, I don't have the little, the little thing, the little tool that people use to do that. My grandmother literally gave me this blow dryer and I just never bought another one so we're gonna make do with my hand and um, some heat. This is actually my favorite part because I just love the way the heat feels on my face and the feeling of my hair blowing. So it may not look like it, but I'm really enjoying it. Okay, so I am pretty much done with applying all the products that I am going to use for this look. And I do want to say thank you guys for tuning in and watching this hair tutorial. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. My name is 5678 and, <laughs> and I will see you guys next time. Bye! 93 Octane, that's gas.